Well, that's not good enough. Looks like we're gonna have to cut it. Hi there, welcome to VSF Recovery Team. We're gonna try and repair our sling or hard bar tonight, which might be a little more difficult than we anticipated. It's pretty beat up. But we like to use it instead of the, uh, well, what I like to call the NASCAR method, or what uh, Rory and uh, the rest of them like to call the soft sling. Why is that? Well, it's because we recover in different types of terrain. This seems to work good for us. It's been working for me for a lot of years, and uh, to be honest with you, I think we've only repaired it two or three times. And yes, it is very wore out. Being wore out might be part of the reason why it works for us. It doesn't bind up. That's what we gotta fix. I think what we're gonna do for now is we're just gonna cut this one off and weld another one on. The other thing you've probably noticed is we don't run the uh, upper and lower bar with the uh, big rubber uh, straps in between. Reason for that is, is we found that that just kind of gets in the way when you're off-road. Way back in the day when they first started building tow trucks, they had all kinds of different types of slings and people kind of manufactured their own and stuff. One of the common ones was the triangle chain and uh, that seems to work real good for us. It's worked uh, for a lot of years, we're going to stick with it. That might be hot. All right, seems to grinding wheel now. This might take a while. There's a lot of weld on there. Okay. That looks clean enough. Now we just got to get a piece to weld on there. Well, I think that just might be our ticket right there. It's the same thickness, uh, just a hair narrower, but it's got the right size hole in it. We'll do a little blacksmithing to take the bend out of it. I think that'll do. Cut that off. Oops, gotta change the wheel.
not hot on this end. I think it's laid on there at a little bit of an angle. That should work. We'll uh, clean the paint off and see if we can weld that on there. So this was a bumper bracket or a bumper support on an H1. They were kind of twisted around and bolted in there as a support. Uh, it's got some really thick paint and primer on it. The old acrometer going here. Let's see. I think that's close enough. Okay, now we can burn that on there. No, we're not gonna do it with three batteries. Not when we have a perfectly good tombstone stick welder over there. And not too bad for just an old farm boy, huh? We're definitely not just gonna leave it at that, though. Well, that ain't going nowhere till it breaks.
14 tow truck again. Like I say, we like using the sling where we're at. Towing that we do in the train that we work in is a little bit different than uh, the rest of those guys out in Utah. So that's why we, uh, we use the hard bar when we can. Thanks for watching BSF Recovery Team. Keep wheeling, be safe out there, and maybe we'll see you out on the trails. Well, that should hold till we break it again. <laughs>